Hey there everyone, welcome back to a brand new episode of Let's Play Oxen Free and the finale, actually. Let's go into the bomb shelter. Listen, Alex, I don't want to say anything to Ren or Nona, but the truth of it is I'm not feeling too awesome right now. It's kind of getting um. worse. Just hang in there, Jonas, okay? I guess. I know you feel like a garbage snowman right now, but we're almost done. Hey, what do you call a man who's short of time? Huh? Is this and a joke? Yeah, it's a... What do you call a man that's short of time? Tim. You call him Tim. Oh, God. <laughs> oh. <laughs> yeah, it's not one of my finest. Sweet things. Jesus. It's... It feels like wrong to see one of these when we're not in a, a time loop, right? <laughs> yeah, it kind of does. It's kind of spooky, right? The beds? Thinking they would have slept here while the rest of us burned? Yeah, but do you think it would even have worked? Like, if if Yugoslavia or whoever dropped an A-bomb on their heads, I don't know if this place would have held up. Yeah, maybe not. It's kind of sad to think about. Wait, it's... Oh, damn, it's another radio wave lock thing. That's the wrong button. Here. Here. Wait, before... There. Look, if something happens on the other side of this door, just... Don't be stupid. Cut and run, okay? If I turn into dead weight or start freaking out, just get to the boat. Do whatever you have to. Jonas, we're all getting out of here. I mean, look, we're about to fix this in two minutes. Two minutes. This is microwave popcorn of a problem. I'm not asking. I'm telling. Uh, no. Look, dream a little dream, buddy. It's not going to happen. I'm not going to leave you. Now, let's just get this door open, do what we gotta, and get home. Wait, 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 wait. Okay, you know what? There's... There's like the tenth time we've heard this song all night. There is something going on with... Jonas. Like, why would this specific tune be all I over... I know this is, like, sensitive for you, Jonas, but we really don't have time to waste here, I don't think. Set a stopwatch. I won't take more than five minutes. It's, like, breaking or something. Can you... can you fix it? I mean, it's just so crazy to keep hearing this, right? It was like a tick she had. <laughs> I don't know. But try and get it playing right if you can. It's... It sounds like it's her. Like a recording, or it's just... It's my mom. That's her voice in the static. You can hear that, right? I mean, I know you don't know what she sounded like, but... You can hear that. The voice, right? Mm, no. This... It doesn't feel right. Something's wrong. Wait, wait, wait. Is it possible? Do you, th do you think it's possible? I mean, we've been, like, talking with ghosts the entire night. Do Jonas. you think it's... Like, it could be, right? I... Jonas, I'm sorry, but I, I really don't think that's her. Like, really her. Well, how would you know? And I mean, you don't know that for sure. Well, I'm not saying I know that for sure, but from the stuff we've seen tonight, it just... This has to be possible, right? God, she's, like, so close. You can just... Can you just try and tune in the signal? This tape player thing isn't even... I have no clue what's going on, but if you could just help me with this right now. Jonas, I know this is tough to understand, but we really should be using the radio to get out of here, and, like, that's it. We have to leave. We don't have to leave. You just want to leave. Come on, I'm sorry, but please, can you try and understand what's happening here? Just please help me out. I'm great. Fine. I just can't... I just can't really get this to change, or... Uh, Mom, can you? Uh, a bad idea.
cloak. Uh, Alex? Jonas, wait! Oh, great. Jonas, where... Where did you go? Come back. Can I walk around? Yep. Great. Now Jonas is gone. Whatever. Into the cave we go. You know, the truth is, we could have left whenever we wanted. We weren't prisoners of the cave. Then why use my friends? Why, why are you switching with them? Why are you doing this? Because it's scary, that's why. Have you ever stared into nothing and moved with it and felt a part in it? It's worse than when we were wilting into atoms. Worse than dying the first time. No, uh... Of course not, but you have to, no matter how hard it is. No, we don't have to. We don't have to do anything, not anymore. Whatever you think you can do, you can't. We're not going back. We won't go back. Child, wait your turn. Hmm. So I definitely can't walk this way, right? Can't just... Leave? Yeah, no. It's caved in. Okay. Radio. Time for one more stint. Mega space triangle. <sighs> okay. Uh, is anybody? Can anybody hear me? Oh. Uh, ghosts? I is that you? The USS Canaloa. Oh. You've come to close the hole. Right, Dad? Well, you're gonna find out it's not that simple. The horses have already left the barn. Yeah, I've come to close the hole. I've come to... to do what Maggie Adler tried to do 50 years ago, all right? <laughs> okay, well, it didn't work then. Why would it work now? God, you're so spoiled. You don't even know the cost of things. <laughs> Closing the hole with your stupid toy will spare your... Your friends from our bloom, sure. But we'll seal you up in here with us. You'll die with us again and again. So think long and hard about those friends. One last chance. You don't have to die. You can leave, you know, through the gate you opened. And we keep the girl. Clarissa. Hell no. With us. What? No way. I'm not. I'm not just gonna abandon Clarissa. I said we going back all together, as bitchy as she is. Do you think we wanted to be thrown away? Like some faulty appliance? We won't let it end like that. We can't. How can I fix it then? Just, just tell me how to fix it. I'm here. I'm in the, the past. For God's sake, I can't. I see Nona in somehow. the corner down there. No, you can't change. Before, you can't change anything. We can feel this binding. You have maybe just a few moments Is that Ren? Left. We feel terrible, we do, but, but you have to know why that everyone chose to forget about us. Everyone just shuttered us away. 
into a back closet of their thoughts. Maggie remembered. She wanted to help you. It, it was all she did was, was try and figure out what had happened. We've watched her in every timeline. Watched her try and understand. Every timeline. Oh, snap. So they're guilt, maybe. across different timelines. There's... <sighs> I know there was a crewman on that submarine named Calvin, and, and to you, to all of you, they didn't forget, okay? They didn't throw you away. Calvin. Was our name ever... Calvin? Oh, Calvin. I almost remember. My name. You were... were people once. Don't lose that part of you to be this. It's... it's... My thing. Calvin Gilbert. It's hard to remember certain things. Our faces went a while ago, and then our names... Names. Our names. But our anger. Our anger is... We're afraid of all we have left. It's kind of the last stitch. That's not all you have. You know that's not all you have. Scrap it. Keep your nature. We'll keep ours. Maggie had, has, will have this friend, and you sort of remind us of her. Strange girl. Odd tempered. Take care. With the time you have left, child, and take notice. Or what you choose to. Whoa. Oh, hey, it's this thing again. Jonas? Jonas, where... Where are you? Okay, this is this is gonna be fine. I get to Just leave a message to my it. past self. I don't remember what she said. Tell Michael to stay with Clarissa. They like each other a lot. But Michael's dead. How could I even? Whoa! Wait, what? What's happening? And another one. Hello? Are you? Look, is someone there? Jonas, if you're still there, this would be a great time to say something. Don't let Jonas talk to his mom. It's not good for him. His mom's dead. I know his mom's dead. What is... How is this possible? What's going on? Well, that could have gone better. Right. Time loop. Tell Michael he should go out on his own. What does this... What does this matter? He's dead. He's not... He's not here. Dead haste, as in dead space. No, that's dead taste. I don't. I don't know what it says. Think void. But yeah, I think that's supposed to be a dead space poster. Lover. All right. So if you're playing along, this game does have multiple endings. I don't know if I just screwed up this particular ending that I was trying to go for, which is basically the save everyone ending. <laughs> oh. Hey, I didn't even know you were home. You're always so quiet. It's like living with a little fairy tale mouse. Wait, did I get booted back in time? I know, I haven't used this desk in like a year, but Dad has all his gear on the kitchen table, so I've been like struggling with this stupid speech, the graduation thing. I don't want it to be just the usual blah blah we've come so far type stuff. It should have like a point, right? It should bring you to your feet about something. Graduation speech, is that what we're talking about? Aw, oh, man, you haven't been listening at all. It's okay, this is really boring. I'm guessing Mom probably told you about my scholarship to state, right? I don't really know how I feel about it. 
I mean, I feel it's not like it's a bad thing. It's a good thing, obviously. It's just, you know, it seems like half the teachers are alumni, and actually, I'm about to be really arrogant and presumptuous and say mean things for no real reason other than I think I know better, so forget it. I've bored you enough. Michael, say it. Come on, you can't take me to the water's edge of an idea here and then not jump in. That's just cruel. No, no, really. I'm talking out of my ass. It's fine. Listen, here's the... <sighs> you can't tell mom or dad, but Clarissa and I are talking about just leaving. Getting an apartment somewhere and, and just doing our own thing, you know? Oh, wow, that's... that's exciting. This is like a huge deal. Like... like the boxcar children version of getting married or something. Uh, it's... yeah, it's kind of a big deal, I guess. It'll be a lot harder to break up, so... there's some level of, uh, vow there. She's been really pushing for it, wanting to look for places, and, uh... I'm into the idea. I really am. I just... I wouldn't feel right about it if I didn't have your, like, blessing first. So, can you just wave your hand over my head or something and say I'm alright to do this? I... God, it's hard for me to say since I love you, of course, but you should do it. Totally. Even if it explodes in a nuclear war-style breakup, you'll regret never trying. Thanks. That means a lot. Alex, just get good friends, okay? And when you're with those friends, just say yes to everything. And keep away from boys when you talk to them, it feels like you're performing. But also, stay away from girls who look you in the eye for too long. And match every beer with a water. And take classes outside of school. Classes you don't need. This ah, is just... Crap. This is a just-in-case package, okay? Just in case I'm not around. And I love you, and you're amazing, and that's it. So... I love you, too. There we go. But soon, I shall be so I cannot remember any... But the things that never happened. Yeah, I... I don't know. Hey, she's waking up. Is she alright? Ouch. Is, um... <clears throat> is everyone doing alright? Aw, I Still, goofed it up. Um, yourselves? Yeah, I think we're all accounted for, right? Yeah, for the most part. Yeah, my arm fell asleep, Jonas but... carried you here. Yeah, 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 okay. The, the important thing is, whatever you did in the cave, it worked. The tear, the hole, it's fixed. The ghosts are gone. We're going home. Or at least they've they've stopped trying to eat our souls. That's I'm I'm glad. I'm sorry. I'm just I was back. I fell back a few years during the whole thing, and I just saw Michael again. That's all. So I'm just a little rattled right now. You saw Mike? What happened? What what was it like? Well, wait, yeah. I just talked to him. He he was there in the Whatever was happening, we talked about his future and what he wanted to do. It was something. I'm sorry, Alex. Yeah, it's... I'm sure it was rough. Yeah. I had oh, my hell. older sister. It was a night where... I don't even remember why she was mad at me. Probably something I said to our mom. But I don't know why that who cares night would visit. I wouldn't put much thought into it, Clarissa. Really. Maybe it's... I don't know, maybe it's like what matters to us showed up or something. The universe doesn't care about what matters to us. Then it doesn't matter anyway. No, I guess it doesn't. I can't believe everything that happened. I just, I feel like we should tell everyone we know. Like, go on a freaking book tour, but let's make a pact to, to just keep it, like, ours. It's only our thing. It happened to us, and nobody else has to be involved. Yeah... I don't know, like it or not, we've had a have a shared thing now. Shared insane thing that I don't think will get reset once like graduation hits or something. Hey, is this your book? Oh man, this is We're gonna be the best couple ever. Uh okay, slow down. I lost it on the way. I thought for sure some commuter would have just tossed it overboard. Hey, that reminds me. What were we We were talking about something stupid right before Alex woke up. Prom? Uh, prom. 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 I am definitely skipping this one. I'm deferring the crown to that wheelchair girl. Are you going, Alex? Are we supposed to still spike the punch or just bring in flasks? Uh, I guess. I mean, if I find a date, you know. I'm not gonna go stag. I have my dignity. Ben Owens will ask you. Or rather, he's going to ask you unless I physically prevent him. Eh, you can do better. Come on, come with me and Nona. We'll go dress shopping. It'll be fun. It'll be like a movie montage, except 
none of us are prostitutes and there's no rich guy. <laughs> Sounds great. Yeah, I mean, I guess I should spiffy up once in my life. All right, just don't say phrases like that while we're out and we'll be solid. All right, you know what? It's picture time. Oh my god, come on. Nona. Um, you guys go ahead. Or, or maybe I can take it up you. Yeah, come on, we'll all do it. Last one of the night. Or day now. Let's, um, let's actually move outside so we can get the light. Sure. Ren, what is that book, anyway? I don't know. I can hardly make heads or tails out of what the hell he's talking about half the time. Here's good for the... yeah, just here. All right, let's take a like, picture. Like, look, I'll just pick a random-ass page. Like, this, here. When I was younger, I could remember anything, whether it happened or not. But soon, I shall be so I cannot remember any but the things that never happened. Yeah, I... I don't know. Wait, didn't you... Jeez. I swear I remember him saying that before at some point. Huh. <sighs> before we'd left, I told my mom I was spending the night at a friend's house. And when I got back, I didn't see any reason to change that story. And you know what? I still don't. The island did one good thing, forcing Ren and Nona together. Which is nice, because they're still together, actually. Though, they go to different schools now. Trying out the long distance thing, I guess. Aww. Awesome. Clarissa left to study English literature. She was thinking of dropping out, but is keeping at it for now. We talk sometimes. Rarely, but sometimes. I hear she's scared of the ocean now. And she got a dog, too, if you care. There you go. That's how you be nice with Clarissa. Jonas was the first to introduce me as his sister. You know, without the step part in front of it. And it was weird at first, but it's the truth. He's my brother. He goes to school in town, and we see each other a lot. It's funny, what happened on the island used to pop into my head every single day, and then every other day. And then a week went by and I realized I hadn't thought about it at all. I guess that's, I don't know, it's good, I think. But anyways, I, um, well, if it matters, I left town to go to school, undeclared. I need time to figure out what I, what I want, I guess. Oh god, no. No. But anyways... Oh, what time is it? <gasps> yeah, sorry, I gotta run or I'll miss the ferry. Ren's dragging me out to Edwards Island for that yearly beach party thing. Oh no. And I have to pick up what's-his-name Jonas, too. No. <sighs> I hope he's not weird or mean or something. No. Whatever. I'm sure it'll be fun. It's something to do, right? No. Get done, did it. That's unfortunate. But there we go, guys. The finale of Oxenfree. Unfortunately, you are stuck in a time loop. And here's what's worse. There is a prevailing theory. If you play through the game again after you beat it, you can actually get a different ending. I don't know if it's going to give it to me now. But it does tell you, you know, it'll, it'll basically hint at the fact that, hey, um... You can actually es basically escape the time loop of, you know, going back onto the island. You can escape it. But the problem is, for each escape that you do, it still leaves one form of Alex in another timeline, basically, stuck on the island in a time loop. So for every Alex that does go into the time loop, there's another Alex that escapes the time loop. There's another game that does something similar about it where, you know, your character has to split their own consciousness across two different paths kind of thing. And it makes it really interesting. I know Jack played it. It's a game where the character gets stuck in the future. He doesn't realize he's a robot. and it, it, It's an interesting game. I might play that game eventually. I haven't seen Jack play it in a hot minute, so I literally remember nothing about the game. But I might play that one too. That one's a fun game. But yeah. Prevailing theory is, you know, 
it's sort of like this you're stuck in a time loop and you're not stuck in a time loop at the same time at the same time kind of thing but there is also like i said this is not the ending that i wanted the ending that i wanted to get would have involved me being able to actually save um michael and yeah i know it might be crossing a little in spoiler territory now but the game did kind of hint at it, the fact that, you know, Clarissa was like a mile away in that picture when they when they stood together. You could actually make it so that, that way Michael survives. When you wake up and you see him there with Clarissa and Jonas and everybody. Yeah. Pardon me. But yeah, so you can make it so that they survive and Jonas is still part of your crew. He's basically a friend, a new kid that moved to town. And yeah, that's... That's what actually ends up happening in the quote-unquote true ending. Problem is, that's still part of the time loop side, so it doesn't matter. You get stuck again anyway. The true quote-unquote ending would basically be the side where you don't get stuck in, uh, or you don't go to the island, you don't get stuck in the time loop, but in that one, it's just you, Jonas, and Ren. You never see Nona, so Nona and uh, Ren never go dating, basically. And, you know, Clarissa, you never make up with her. It's just kind of a crappy thing that happens. So, it kind of gets rid of some of the happy endings you could have made for all these other people. So, it, it's kind of sad, but at the same time, it's really interesting. But, personally, this is one of my favorite games. I love this game. I love the music. I love the ambiance that the game gives you and I really do like it because you could play the game 100 different times and choose different you know dialogue options and you know I'm sure if, if I had actually recorded the very first time I played this without seeing Jack play it or even if I had seen Jack play it like you know <sighs> excuse me my dialogue options now compared to what I did back then were probably vastly different like, I don't think the same way, you know, I might not act the same way, so on and so forth. But it's a really fun game. You know, if you have the chance, I say go buy it. It's a great game. And, you know, maybe even catch up on the the alternate reality game thing that they had going on with the treasure hunt and all that stuff in real life. It's a great story and it's a great read. Other than that, guys, I will catch you all here next time. So, I don't know what I will be having take the space of Oxenfree on Saturdays. I'll think of something. But for now, I might just slide in, you know, a second day of Undertale or a second day of another Let's Play that I think is going to be either A, really long, or B, really short. So that way I can get stuff done a little bit faster. I want to try to clear up the, the Let's Play stuff on the daily. So that way I might drop it down to maybe two or three different series running at the same time rather than having seven. Because while I do like the 7, you know, the, the progress is starting to slow down for some of the longer Let's Plays. So, you might see 2 or 3 days straight of one particular content. Other than that, guys, I will catch you all here next time. I hope you all have a great and wonderful day. Oh, wait, I forgot to say the rest of the outro. If you liked today's episode, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. Leave a comment down below. Hit the subscribe button if you aren't already a part of the Curly Crew. And hit the notification bell. Now... I hope you all have a great and wonderful day.